No individual should have to wait months to receive care for an illness that could be life-threatening. Since living in um, western Nebraska, it usually takes about two to three months to get an appointment with a doctor that you haven't seen before. Um, I would love to have my therapist be able to prescribe my medications. I feel like it would be um, more accurate, more efficient, and, and I would have a lot more um, comfort in knowing that that individual who truly knows me and that I've been able to trust and open up with um, handle my medications that do affect you know, my, my body, my chemistry, I think that's huge. In the rural areas of New Mexico, the problem is enormous. And it is those areas where uh, the prescriptive authority for psychologists um, hasn't merely been um, helpful, it's been essential. And psychologists not only treat and evaluate those patients, but have shortened the waiting time to see a prescriber and have given prescriptions that would otherwise be unavailable. I went to medical school. I spent four years in medical school. I spent three years in residency. Unless you do that, you don't know how to prescribe. And um, there's no evidence to support that. And so we believe in evidence-based medicine, right? We should also look at evidence-based education and determine the weight of that. For prescriptive authority, um, for um, psychologists, it's a postdoctoral master's degree. Very rigorous education. Many of them will say that they really like having the therapy and the medication management by the same person. And they feel like it's the medication is being more closely watched and they appreciate that because a psychologist tends to see his or her patients pretty frequently, there's a possibility of going up more slowly on medications and watching very carefully the effects and side effects. If you're on medication, you usually would benefit from some type of psychotherapy. Having an, in, or having an individual or a, a psychologist that could prescribe medications um, you're getting both of those services with one visit. You're not having to pay for a psychiatrist, which is difficult to get into, um, and then also pay your psychologist to do your therapy. You've got both, and it's, it's really all-encompassing and more, um, I feel it would be, you know, a, a better outcome for individuals. So I became very interested in whether or not it would be possible for us to be able to prescribe here in New Mexico with the appropriate training, with the thought in mind that we would better meet the needs of the community and that psychologists really have something to contribute because we're psychotherapists first. At least with a psychologist, um, you have more options and it definitely is important that you have uh, that relationship and that therapeutic relationship with your uh, psychologist that you're going to see so that you can trust and open up to them. At this point in New Mexico, it's not at all surprising to have someone call the office and say, I want one of those prescribing psychologists. They, they know what they do, uh, they know it's something different and it's a model that they like.